is a game of inches. Every play, every snap, every block, every catch, every kick matters. Now you look me dead in my eyes and tell me that you've got something more important to do in the next 20 minutes. I've been to your house. I know what your room looks like. I know darn well that you don't have anything going on. You're pathetic. Absolutely. Who? Abominably. You're a disgrace to your parents. You're a disgrace to your family. You're a disgrace to your community. But today, for the next 25 minutes, you can forget about that. Shit! Because it's the national championship! Oregon Ducks season has gone exactly how we've wanted. Our team captain, Mariota, has carried us here so far. Our stud running back, Ali Gordon. Our wide receiver trio of Travis Hunter, Jaden Higgins, and Mike Evans. With Mark Andrews taking the helm at tight end. A very solid offensive line anchored by USC's Jonah Mon and a defense star-studded with Will Johnson, Ray Lewis, Brian Erlacher, Sauce Garden. One game left to determine the fate of our team. Now, the most important thing, we've made the national championship. That means we can prestige one more player. Keep in mind, next episode, the entire team will reset except for our prestige players. Our current prestige players are James Pierce Jr., Will Johnson, and Travis Hunter. So we've got to decide one more. I'll just be straight up with you. I do have two wheel spins on on today's episode, so that could change things, but right now, I think it should be Jonah Monheim. He's got an 88 overall in the game. He's an excellent offensive lineman, and it's so hard to go back to all silver offensive line, dude. You get blown up everywhere with an all silver O line. Now, Mark Andrews, Mike Evans, these would be nice prestiges, but are they gonna get another better card in the future? Keep in mind, when I prestige a player, I'm always entitled to the best version possible. I, I highly doubt Mark Andrews or Mike Evans get another card. I just don't see it. Now, Ali Gordon, he's gonna get another card. Travis Hunter, he's gonna get another card. Monheim, maybe. Defensively, if I prestige anybody, I feel like maybe Sauce Gardner, maybe Ray Lewis, but I'm leaning Monheim. The wheel spin will decide for us. Keep in mind, I could always use this wheel spin on a potential prestige player. So just picking up a player that I know could be good in the future, and I think that's exactly what we're gonna do since this is team wheel 82 to 83. We're spinning our comically large wheel. We can get one 82 to 83 overall player from whatever team this lands on. We're in the M's. Ooh. Terrapins is not bad at all. It could be a lot worse. It could be a lot better too. Maryland, do you have 82 to 83s? They've got an 84 wide receiver, Caden Prather. They've got Jalen Husky. They should definitely have somebody. Michael Harris, left outside linebacker. He could be okay. There's an 82 right end. There's an 82 middle linebacker. Dude, this is a fast right end. Donald Brown, 6'4", 80 speed, 82 excel. I'm actually gonna take him and move him to backup D tackle. I think he's gonna be better than Ruben. That's very fast right end. To be honest, we need a really strong wheel spin to make a big upgrade here. That or if Maryland had a guard, that would have been good because I do need guards. But that, actually, a fullback would have worked too. But either way, Ruben Bain's in right now at D tackle two. Donald Brown's actually a lower overall. I'm not sure I'll be able to do much with this guy here. Yeah, Donald Brown is just not going to get reps on this team. Although I don't think there was anybody I could have taken there that would have gotten reps. So the wheel gives and the wheel takes. First wheel spins a wash. I'm not going to lie. Best case scenario here, we get a God Squad player or I would also take. Ooh. That was not on my mind, but it may work. Three packs from the store. We're looking for offensive linemen or anything 84 overall or higher. The ultimate alumni premium pack. I'm gonna do three different packs just for fun. This guarantees an 82 plus though. Oh, shh. No way. Dude, we had this dude already. We had his, in oh my God. If that's my 82 plus, that's actually a bummer. Although I guess he's a slightly better backup at back. Dylan Carpenter, 81 left outside linebacker. He's not gonna help us. Hey, I love getting a Spartan. Although I, I don't think you're gonna get a rep either. You're not gonna get a rep either. Final player is blue. Hey, 81 left tackle, but oh, can't use you either. I have a better left tackle. Damn, there's like a, a semi-decent pack and it doesn't help us. All right, next up is a Legends Fantasy Pack. Now this this is actually crazy good because of the prestige options for it, right? So, 82 Laramie Tunzel, he has an 87 overall, so I could prestige it. Good option. Second legend. Oh, good fucking Crabtree. Now there's a sick prestige, true. You go Michael, you go Michael Crabtree on a prestige. Are you kidding? Final legend? Okay, so obviously we can't go Ray Lewis. We go Michael Crabtree and Laramie Tunzel. Laramie Tunzel might be a better left guard than what I have. Those are actually two really good potential prestiges, too. Final pack is this conference stories premium pack. 
Hilariously, that's our first upgrade. David Shanahan, we got a bunter, a Georgia Tech bunter. That's crazy. He's an upgrade, dude. He's an upgrade. And then this is also an 82 plus right here, guaranteed. Hey, maybe you're a better guard than what I have. Maybe. Let's go see what we can do with this lineup. Okay, so right now as our backup hatback, we have Jalen Buckley. And Jalen Buckley has 80 speed. Cooley has 80 speed. I think I keep Jalen Buckley. Oh, wait, let's put Quentin Cooley at fullback. Okay, we technically have a fullback now because of this. Quentin Cooley is a 73 overall fullback that is an upgrade. No longer Clay Russell. Ben Rather. I actually like him at left guard better because he's technically an 82 overall. So we'll throw him in. Laramie Tunzel is a bit of a downgrade, so I can't throw him at guard. Yeah, I mean, we're scraping the bottom of the barrel here, but see, like, dude, safeties? Like, safeties would have been so good. A D-tackle, guards. Hey, that's what happens when you get packs, though. But guess what? We got an 82 overall puncher, which potentially I could need. It's literally possible. All right, gentlemen, take it in because this is the last time you're going to see this lineup. It's a beautiful lineup. We're an 83 overall. We've made so many big plays. We just need one final game with big plays. And arguably the most important challenge wheel of the year. I'll talk about that for, oh, score first TV. I would love that. Ooh. This is actually a great challenge to get. We had it last episode, but we had a rage quit, so we didn't get to see it through. We'll get to see it through today in the national championship. 120 plus all-purpose yards with our running back. And this is the most important challenge because it guarantees us a pack from the store. And on next episode, I will have almost all silvers. So a pack from the store would be huge. You can see it right there on your screen, baby. National championship. Do you have what it takes to earn a national title? Win it here and prove you do. Oh, damn well, I'm gonna prove it. Boy, come on. Oh, oh, we get to see top threes, even though it's the Natty Chip. That's kind of sick. They don't let you see that, Madden. Colin Oliver, Chris. Yeah, I mean, hey, it's the national championship. We know he's going to have a God squad, right? Oregon versus Arkansas. Oh, look at the gold theme. Holy shit, that gets me bricked up. Look at the gold theme. He's got an 85 overall. We've got an 83. I'm starting on defense, which is huge. I love starting on defense. I absolutely despise starting on offense. Okay, that's... Are you fucking kidding me? Got him. Thank God. What a horrible way to start a game. But hey, he didn't house it. Here we go! He's got Lamar at QB. Starts this game out with a handoff. Takes some big hits. Dude, look at the presentation. The gold flakes. That doesn't get you amped up. I don't know what will. I expect a heavy ground game from him. Because this is another run. Yep. Oh, I'm there. Oh, fuck. He's fast. Stop. What kind of fucking animation was that? He just wobble stumbled so hard that it wigged out my defender. That's a crazy way to start the natty. Not only that, but he bounced it. Oh, that's gross. That's just gross. We gotta go score now, boys. And he's gonna scum kick, you fucking pussy. Well, now I really wanna win. Oh, look at that, it's four minute quarters. Ain't over till it's over, baby. Ali Gordon, take three. We're gonna go jet touch pass here. I haven't ran a lot of this this year, but I wanna try it out. He's flying over with Colin Oliver. Take a decent three yards. That definitely could have been better. He's heavy on the left side, on this right side. It's all run game so far, but we got the first. Slow and steady wins the race. I always say some shit like that, like slow and steady wins the race, and then I throw a pick. So my goal right now is to not do that. <laughs> Damn, you're dead. Second and ten. Let's take a peek. Easy. Ooh. Yo, this patch, this patch has you breaking tackles in the weirdest ways. I have never broken a tackle like that before. Third and inches. Good lord. What the, like, what the fuck? What was that? Nice first down, though. First and ten. I knew that was going to get him. I sent that same route to the left side last time, so I knew it'd get him if I sent it to the right. Okay, we're, we're playing really well right now. Let's just keep this up. Ollie Gordon's getting tired, though. I may low-key need to sub in Jalen Buckley. Let's go ISO run here. Away from Erlacher, that's his user. Second and two at the gut. Ooh, God. Look at that push. Just got fucking dogged there. Love this play. Verts FN. Oh, shit. Broken up, thank God. Fourth and two. Got to get a huge conversion here. Fourth and two. Biggest play so far. Right into Mark Andrews. Oh, is he not? He just fucking rolled. He rolled himself inside of that first down. That is fucking insane. Seven to zero, and it's his ball. Yup. No, stop. 
Stop. Stop, 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 stop. You gotta get the ball back. Oh, this is gonna be a brutal game. Bodies. Third and seven. Bodies. Great work, gentlemen. It's going empty. I'm on 18. Oof. Good juke. Good juke. That was my responsibility. I thought it was a slant. I could have made a play there. A really big play. Definitely a run play now after all that. Yeah. Get off your blocks, gentlemen. Good tackle. It's going to be all run plays. Yep. Oh, my God. Perfect blocks right into the end zone. It ain't over. It is definitely not over. Fuck you, pussy. Dot. So fucking dot. First and ten. I got to lock in. Sorry, boys. Commentary's going down for a sec. Second and 10, let's go with a run. Can't give up on the run. Get inside his user. Ooh, nice play. Third and seven. Beauty. Fourth and one, though. Press man coverage, fourth and one. <laughs> he dropped it. I had Higgins, though. I had Higgins so easy. Ooh, good move. Good move. Good heat. Second and 19. I need him to fumble. Wow. Nice looking play. He's going to run this ball into the end zone. This game is not over, but at all. Dot. Oh, dude, I had the two unluckiest fourth down conversions, which I should have scored on both of those, but it doesn't matter. This game is not over. I don't care what it looks like. Doesn't matter to me. We need seven before half. We have to get seven before half. Then put up seven more when I get the ball at half. It's a one possession game and we gotta find a stop somewhere in there too. This could be a touchdown. I'm literally in coach's suggested plays because all the shit I was calling was ass. Ooh. Hoping to be able to make a play there. Ali Gordon decoy. Yep. Oh my fucking god, he dropped it again. There's no way you just let me do that. <laughs> Come on! This game's not over. At all. I give a shit what you were typing in the comments. It's seven to zero and I get the ball. I just need someone slow to get this. Oh my god, he's got a hit stick fumble on that. It's my ball, 21 to seven, my ball. You're such a pussy. Just such a fucking pussy. It's gonna feel really good to come back and beat you. Oh, I'll talk about this for years. For years when I win this game. Dude, when he runs a run play, I don't touch him till 10 yards. These guys block shed like no other. First down, and a little more. Clock's not our friend. Good thing it's four minute quarters, but clock is still not our friend. Ooh. He actually played that well. Damn, Ollie Gordon's taking fucking hits right now. Play action. He's going, Mark Andrews. Not the best pass. Like, well, dude, what is with this patch? Broken tackles are so bizarre. But, hey, stay up, boys. This game ain't over. Should have done that. Should not have done that. Shut the fuck up. He's not within it. Oh, that's so tilting. What a perfect ball. Hi okay, sure. Sure, sure, sure. What a fucking play. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't care what the score says. This game ain't over. Yeah, yeah, now you go take him, huh? 
We're here, boys. We're here, we're here, we're here. Now we sit in the pocket and throw Mark Andrews because he's seen this so much. Oh, I could have. Everybody settle the fuck down. Coach, you don't want me to kick the PAT? Suck my dick and balls. Kick the PAT. Everybody settle down. 14 points unanswered. Gotta stop my defense now. Everybody settle down. Please don't let him house a kick. He's already getting like crazy good blocks. I really am nervous about this. Beautiful. Great stop. Okay, he needs an 80-yard drive here. He wants to chew clock and kick a field goal. That's the name of the game for him right now. Luckily, we got four-minute quarters. He's ran this run play a hundred times, and no matter what I do, he gets so fucking many yards on it. Is it the angles? Is it his team? I don't get what that play is. I'm shifting my line. I have the personnel group to stop it. He's gonna run it again and again and again and again and again. And then he can just switch sides if I shift. Yup! Wow, I couldn't have called that any better. But that's a TFL. Third and three, we found a way to stop it. Gun empty trio. On Denzel Burke here, he's got a whip route. It's bagged. I have this, it's bagged. Can't cover everything. Oh, strip it. Fucking strip it. Oh, I really defended that well, other than obviously. Good defense. We need more of that if we're gonna get a stop. Pistol wing, it's the same thing. So they're just like, what side are you running this to? Unless he has a pass bay out of this. Nope. Same fucking thing. Run to the edge. Beautiful stop, Erlacher. Now he's gonna go empty. I think I know what he's gonna do here on third and 10. Whip route. Oh, two whip routes. Good tackle, fourth and five. He can't hit this field goal. This is our opportunity. Same thing, empty trio. Yes, fucking sir! Let's go! Fourth and five, user alert. Stay with me now! He knows what I'm doing. Beautiful movement. Beautiful movement. I can't believe I got fucking hoed on that fourth and one where Mark Andrews rolled backwards. That's the difference right now in this game. It's a huge difference in this game. He knows what I'm doing. I'm not fucking reinventing the wheel right now. That's a beautiful ball. I have to go into overtime. He's gonna score if he gets the ball again. Second and three, I'm going inside zone. I haven't ran it in a long time. Dude, what are these fucking block sheds? What is going on? Third and one. Quick snap, cut it up the middle. Ow. Ollie Gordon, I, you can't fumble, buddy. You fumble, this game's over. That easily could have been a fumble. We gotta let the clock go. We gotta let the clock go. We have to, we, we have to score and hit a PAT with no time left. I could go for two. I don't have it in me, though. My short game is not good. His D-line is killing me. I can't go for two. Gotta let this clock burn. I gotta score with no time left. Make it 21 to 21. We're going into overtime. All the mo- Oh my god, that's so scary. I just realized he had a blue on that. Good defense. I thought he was running the same thing. Okay, so he's gonna cover two now. Okay, so Ali, I need you on the left side. Ali is so gassed. Oh! <laughs> you know how many times Lamar's been in the open field getting smacked around? I just got dragged down from behind and the ball popped out like a fucking hot potato. Oh, that really ruined what was a really epic fucking game. I was about to score 21 straight on answer. Oh, shit. Fourth and six, does he punt? He does. Dude, I'm so demoralized. I'm so demoralized. We had so much fucking momentum. Ungodly momentum. You gotta get creative with our play calling here, though. I think I want Ollie Gordon in the middle so that I can playmaker him up the field. He sees it. Oh my God, he couldn't have thrown that ball. That's a hard ball. I can't be pissed about that. That's such a hard ball to throw. It was there though. It was actually there if that was a perfect ball, but you can't really expect a perfect ball there. I almost just got to test Mike Evans here. Oh my fucking God, you're kidding. The double team on that, man. This is the last play of the game. Ollie Gordon blocking the fucking air. 79 blocking the air while I get sacked there. I can't even throw it that far. 
That was such a bummer. I didn't throw any interceptions. I actually played such a good game. He had a turnover because I lurked him. I had a turnover because fucking Mariota fumbled. There were so many little things that could have gone differently in that game. And I honestly, it might've been an easy win. We had two fourth and ones. One was a drop and one he caught it and rolled himself under the first. This was that first round that was a touchdown. So he breaks this tackle and then this wobble run makes my defender wig out. He runs right past him. Touchdown. Um, we throw this laser to Mark Andrews on the, on the final seconds. Scary as shit, but we got it. Good work. This is the ball game right here. Be 21 to 21. Uh, can't throw Mike Evans. I can't throw that. I mean, this is the right read. I can't throw anything. Although I should step up to the right side instead of the left. I saw a double team on him though. I thought we were good. The fuck is that? Why are you doing that? What, you, what made you do that? It doesn't even make physical sense. Why did you flick your arm up like that? Why did you... Why did you do it? What were you trying to do? It makes me even sicker to know that I did not throw an interception and I lurked him. It makes me, that makes that so much worse. Andy scum kick. That's it for Oregon Duck season, not the finish that we wanted. Oh, well, we're gonna have a big redemption tour next season where we come back and try to come out on top, finally take home a national championship because we have none after our first season. Oh, I didn't check stats. Do we think Ollie Gordon had it? Ollie Gordon had a good amount of yards. I don't know if he had it or I'll have to go to the, I'll have to go to the stat sheet to see if Ollie Gordon had it. I have no idea if he had it or not. Hey, I appreciate you boys for watching as always. And next season's redemption season, we'll maintain Travis Hunter, James Pierce Jr., Will Johnson, and whatever player I choose as our prestige. Gotta go sleep this one off. Hey, I love you boys. Thanks for watching as always. See you in the next video. Peace.